Monday and I'm doing shots of milk because I can. Did you know that the sequence of letters O, U, G, H can be pronounced in eight different ways and the following sequence contains them all? A rough-coated, doe-faced plowman strode through the streets of Scarborough, coughing and hiccuping thoughtfully. There are roughly 6,500 spoken languages in the world today. However, 2,000 of those have less than 1,000 speakers. Twelve or more cows is known as a flink. A group of frogs is called an army. A group of rhinos is called a crash. Kangaroos, a mob. Ravens, a murder. Officers, a mess. Larks, an exaltation. And owls is a parliament. Did you know that the shortest complete sentence in the English language is go? Did you know that the dot above the I is called a tittle? An underground is the only word in the English language to begin and end with und. Felix, did you know that the only cure for hangover is more alcohol? Uh, all you need is one drink. Champagne works, works best because it gets into the bloodstream the fastest. Did you guys know that sherbet is Australian slang for beer? Because I didn't, but my book tells me it is, so... The chocolate and hazelnut spread called Nutella is barely known in America. I'm not sure when this book was written. I think it's a bit outdated. Did you know that the study of nose picking is called rhinotilexomania? Rhinotilexomania. Mariana, because we were talking about insects the other day, did you know that formicophilia is the fetish for having small insects crawl on your genitals? Megali, did you know that Shakespeare invented the word assassination? Did you know that men are four times more likely to commit suicide than women? And Monday is the preferred day for people to commit suicide? So, this isn't a good place to be at the moment. A Malcrypto Vesti Mentophiliac is someone who compulsively steals women's underwear. Did you know a Dynamaniac is someone who has a compulsive urge to dance? That's not going to happen. There are more plastic flamingos in the United States than there are real ones. The WD in WD-40 stands for Water Displacer, and the 40 is just because it took them 40 attempts to get it right. Miriam, did you know that the fear of Halloween is called Samhainophobia, and the fear of alcohol is Methylphobia? Genitofemoral neuropathy means my genes are too tight. Megali, did you know that in a five card game of poker, there are 2,598,960 possible hands? A pound of house flies contains more protein than a pound of meat. Mariana, did you know that the average lifespan of a taste bud is 10 days? And that you use over 70 muscles to say one word. Okay, that's probably enough guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. Just a bunch of random facts from the book. The book's called The Mega Book of Useless Information. But, if you're clever you'll find a use for it. As for last week, I've got to catch up, I guess. Um, we don't celebrate Thanksgivings here, for those of you who are still wondering. I think I told everyone in the group. Um, Christmas is the pretty much only holiday around this time. I don't know if you count New Year's as a holiday. Um, we don't do anything too traditional in terms of traditions. We have a Christmas tree, uh, Miriam. I've never had a real Christmas tree by your standards. I think it was you talking about it. Um, yeah, we've always had plastic trees, just because that's what it is in Australia. We have a bunch of Christmas decorations that come out every year. And we, we hang a little Santa guy up outside the house and little figurines and stuff. Um, probably one of my favourite family traditions that we have but it sort of dwindled off the last couple of years, we don't do it as religiously, is uh, we always used to watch Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas on Christmas Eve. On Christmas Day, we always go and have either lunch or dinner with the extended family on my dad's side. And because Christmas is in the summer here, it's not uncommon for Christmas Day to involve a fair amount of swimming for us. Just enjoy the sunshine, go for a swim, that sort of thing. Alright, I think that's it. This is going to be a 
a bitch to edit, so I'm going to stop there. I look forward to seeing what you guys do with this week's theme, because we haven't spoken about it. Uh, interpret it however you want. You can either do what I did, read out a bunch of random facts, or you can do a did you know about yourself. I don't know. Use your imagination. And yeah, I look forward to that.